Psalm 46 verses 1 to 3 says, God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. Therefore we will not fear, even though the earth be removed, and though the mountains be carried into the midst of the sea, though its water roar and be troubled, though the mountains shake with its swelling. We pray for all those people who have become sick over the last few weeks and months. We ask that you will be with the families who lost loved ones recently. We thank you for all the key workers that have helped us throughout the COVID-19 pandemic. We pray especially for doctors, nurses, paramedics, care workers and hospital staff who have gone above and beyond working tirelessly to help the sick. As the school year officially comes to an end, we pray for all the children who have missed so much of their education and have not been able to socialise with friends over the past few months. We especially pray for those that are due to take exams next year and the apprehension missed teaching may lead to. We also think of those children who will be moving to new schools or to university and will have to experience a very challenging environment and different way of learning. We ask that you grant wisdom to our government as they move to reduce the restrictions in places across the country. We ask that they ensure that safety is always at the forefront of their preparations. Finally, we pray for Steve, the wardens and the other church staff as they prayerfully consider how to go about reopening the church safely. We ask all these things in Christ's name. Amen. 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 Creator God, you made us all in your image. May we discern you in all that we see and serve you in all that we do. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And now we'll say the Lord's Prayer. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. And forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. <laughs>